Hello everyone, I hope you guys are doing absolutely fine. Recently, lots of you have been requesting me for the build of Absol. So I have decided that in this video, I will show you one of the most deadliest one-shot damage build of Absol. So you can deal brutal amount of damage to the enemy. But dealing damage is not enough to win a match. You must also know how to do jungle with Absol, how to do the rotation, and what are the objectives that you must capitalize while playing Absol. But don't worry, in this video, we will cover all these topics along with the build of Absol. So if you are new here make sure to subscribe to my channel so you can get more this type of unite content. Now without wasting any time let's begin the video. First thing first, here's the build for Absol. As you can see, I'm using scope lens to increase the critical damage, razor claw to increase both attack and critical damage, and muscle band to increase the attack speed and attack damage. With these three items, you can literally one-shot any squishy Pokemon. And this is the boost emblem that I'm running on Absol. But if you don't have gold emblem, you can also use this bronze boost emblem. You just have to copy the color combination. Naughty boy civil eye, he almost took my buff. By the way, in this match I got 19 kills and deal total of 100k damage, which is really a huge amount of number. And I promise you, this match will be super super interesting. So watch the video till the end. And you might see another fight over here. Now everything is cleared in the top lane, so it's time to get back in the jungle. And it seems like my teammates are fighting in the top lane, but for now I will ignore them because I must reach level 7 as soon as possible. Why do I feel like this evil eye holds grudge against me? Anyways, you will see another fight over here. That was kinda bad luck. I pressed my unite move multiple times but it didn't work. Anyways, let's get back into the fight. That was such an intense fight, but we weren't able to stop Reziliki. Now it is time for me to farm a little bit, so I can charge my unite move. And after that I might go in the bottom lane, because in the bottom lane Reziliki has already respawned. And Reziliki is one of the most important objectives, especially in the mid game. So always try to contest for it, seems like enemies are already there.
Now it's time to go in the top lane because in the top lane Regilicke will respawn soon. And if you are watching this, always secure or try to contest for the last Regilicke before the final stretch. If you somehow manage to secure the last Regilicke, it will give a really hard time to the enemy in the final stretch because either they have to contest for the Rayquaza or stop the Regilicke. This is why it is the best strategy to secure the Regilicke before the final stretch. Now you might see another fight over here. That's it for today guys and if this video was helpful for you please don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel.